spot is the most remote inhabited island in the UK? Is it an island in the Outer Hebrides perhaps? Or even the tiny islet known as Rockall to the west? Well this is remote but it is not inhabited. Also the UK and Ireland seem to have disputed claims over it. Perhaps it's an island in the Shetland archipelago then? Well you're getting warmer. It is a Shetland island but perhaps not where you thought. It's an island so remote that they even tell time differently there. This is because the island remained on the Julian calendar when the rest of the UK adopted the Gregorian calendar in 1752. As a result, it is now one day ahead of the Julian calendar and 12 days behind the Gregorian calendar. Observing Christmas Day on the 6th of January and New Year's on the 13th of January. Tragedy has also struck this island over the centuries. In the 18th century, a smallpox outbreak struck the island of around 200 people, wiping out around 90% of the population. Although there are a few contenders, the most remote inhabited island in the UK is generally considered to be Fuller. It's said to lie on the edge of the world, around 20 miles west of Shetland mainland. It's so remote that I can't even drop the wee guy on Google Maps to view it in more detail. Covering around 5 square miles, its name derives from an Old Norse word meaning bird island. Unsurprisingly given its location and the influence of Viking Norsemen on Shetland more broadly, the Vikings conquered Fula around 800 AD. Fula was one of the last places to speak the now extinct Old Northern language, a North Germanic language spoken in the Northern Isles of Shetland and Orkney until the mid 19th century. A subcircular stone feature was discovered in Fula in 2006, elliptical in shape, with the axis pointing towards the midwinter solstice. It is a man made structure estimated to be over 3,000 years old made up of around 290 stones, showing the depth of history even in this tiny remote island. Today, Fula is home to around 35 islanders, along with thousands of birds, hundreds of sheep, Shetland ponies, and even its own subspecies of field mouse. The island is so remote that it's not connected to the national grid, and it has to run its own electricity system. There are also many great diving spots around Fula, with many shipwrecks surrounding the island. One is the RMS Oceanic, owned by the famous White Star Line, makers of the Titanic, which ran aground close to the island at the start of World War I after being commissioned into the Royal Navy. Another remote island close to Fula is Fair Island, known in Norse as the Island of Tranquility, but that may be a story for another time. Speaking of these islands, what is the genetic history of Britain? To find out, please click here. Thanks for watching. For ways to support, um, they will all be in the description below. Please also let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.